Welcome to London. Welcome to the History Lord Channel. You join me here just below the uh, Elizabeth Tower, Big Ben as everyone knows it, and you join me here by this strange looking object on the banks of the Thames. Lots of people walk past it, they come out the entrance to the tube station here and nobody knows what it is. Well, it's actually a tide recorder. It's here to measure the depth of the Thames at this particular point here. It's part of London's flood defences along with, oh, I don't know, the lions on the walls of the embankment and the Thames barrier, which is further down this river to the east of here. Inside this, there are lots of wires, lots of computers doing lots of wonderful readings to try and keep Londoners safe. We stood here in this part of Westminster that was actually Thorley Island. It's where the Tyburn split and flowed into the Thames. It's where we also believe Romans actually could wade across the Thames. They believed it was only waist high here and there is evidence of that that they found over towards St Thomas's Hospital a few years ago in archaeological digs. In 1952 Rufus Alexander Buxton, the second Baron Noel Buxton, tried to prove that and he tried to walk across the Thames from St Thomas's to the Palace of Westminster. On the 25th of March 1952, the six foot three pier started from St Thomas's side, fully closed and waded into the river. When the water got up to his neck, he decided to give up and swim back. Well, he did look a forlorn sight. But now back to this mundane piece of street furniture. It's here to protect Londoners from the ever rising tide of the Thames. And let's hope that it's here for a few more years to come. Thank you for watching. If you have enjoyed the video, then please do subscribe to the channel. And if you want to know when videos are uploaded, then please hit the little notification button, which is just down below. And if you want to see what we do outside of these videos, then please go to historylord.co.uk and see about my walking tours of London, or check in the comments below and see about James's YouTube channel as well. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you very soon.